Hey, welcome to Cause 3D. So we thought we'd give you a nice little tour today of the shop. So this is where all the magic happens. This is our 30 by 30 workspace that we use. Uh, we've got another 30 by 30 on the other side that uh, we use for storage and some other stuff. You see here, uh, Jake's working on a helmet for a customer right now, or maybe he's even doing that in front of us I'm not sure. But uh, it's our sanding area. We've got all our sanding tools that we need. Uh, of course, over here, we've got our video editing stuff that we'll, where we do our videos and produce our videos. Uh, back here, we have our printer area, or part of it anyway. These are the uh, Creality K1 Maxes that we have over here that we just got uh, the end of last year. We love these printers. They do the workload of about six or seven other printers, so they're, they're very efficient. Of course, we've got our Prusa XL uh, for larger prints and projects that we need. Uh, three Ender 5s that we use occasionally for some jetpack bodies and so forth. Of course, this is the uh, this is the employee goof off area that we have to at least get a few rounds of golden tea in every single day. Uh, we couldn't we couldn't work with each other if we didn't have this uh, painting area. Of course, the painting area is a vented area over here that uh, evacuates all of our paint fumes and works pretty well for what we need it for. This we got paint storage here and some other just 3D printed stuff that uh, we store up there between conventions and so forth. Uh, hitting you over here and this is the uh, resin printing area and we've got a Saturn II uh, LED Mars that we use right now on that. Uh, curing station for our UV curing station for the resin printed parts that we do in the shop. Uh, moving on down here, we've got the storage area, uh, stuff coming in and out all the time. We're a little low on stuff right now. We're gearing up for a couple conventions this summer. I think our next convention's in uh, March, and then we have to shoot right back over in April, August, and October, no, December this year. We've got quite a few of them set up. Uh, that's what all the public boxes are over here that we've got. We're getting ready to get those into the trailer for the season and then that's about a tenth of what we actually have to have with us so we're in full production mode right now of course the exercise machine that we literally never use uh that we could definitely stand to use bunch of projects over here just sitting out of the way i mean you know some tools in the back that we use on a weekly ish basis when we need it. Uh, everything's on rollers. We can get things out of the way when we need to. But uh, even a random Jeep bumper that we're designing some end caps for right now. So if you look in the middle there, if you didn't already see it, we've got the main workbench where we do the majority of our work and the majority of our filming. But we just have a good old time in here. So hey, Thanks for joining us on this super short video and hope you learned something about the workspace. And on behalf of Zach, Jake, and I, make sure you like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next video.